just so you get a sense of what's going on here, Tetris Alex T, two-time and uh, two-time reigning CTM champion, a winner in December and January, beginning his quest to make it three in a row. That is very rare air indeed. I think Corian might be the only one, right? Uh, and he's gonna have to get through the captain, Somalian captain, uh, of no particular distinction. Just kidding, no, of course. Uh, captain, a perennial c contender here in the Masters event, looking to, uh, looking to make it deep. Trying to go deep. It's gonna be a tough, I mean, look at the, look at the field he's gotta go through, though. He's gotta win out. To get to the finals, Captain has to beat a bracket that includes Pixel Andy, Tetris Time, Tegamex, Sidnev, Tetris Alex T, Trap Zone, and Jerpy Dude. And you could say that of all of them. I mean, that is a, that is a murderer's row. So, uh, yeah, that is going to be real difficult, but, you know, whatever. Captain belongs winner of Challenger Circuit. So he got through a tough field to make it here, so let's see if he can continue. And everybody in chat here is ready for Classic Tetris Monthly Masters Event Blue Bracket match number one. Alex T versus the captain. Here we go. Three, two, one, Tetris. Yeah, these professional, professional streamers are telling me, yes, you have to put your, you have to put your number of subscribers on the screen so that people will know that you know hey we want people to subscribe and we're tracking it like i don't know that seems a little a little much for me i don't know i don't like to i don't like to exploit the audience too much <laughs> i you know teenagers fine but not the audience All right, Alex T on the board with two Tetris is 46,360 for both. Nine lines apiece. Oh, Alex T going to miss the Z spin. All right, Tetra, I gotta stop. I can't read the, the chat. I'll read the chat in between matches because that's the part that Pumpy edits out. So that's that's when I will interact. 74,000 here for the Captain 121 for Alex T. We can barely see some fingers there in, in the board, I, uh, in the uh, cam area. I guess that's good enough. Whatever, it's only... It's only uh, sixteen hundred dollars on the line, you know. <laughs> Fourteen uh, one hundred forty-four thousand, very gross for Alex. One forty-six for the captain. I'm gonna stuff that L in there and bang Tetris. All right, Alex T set up long bar. We'll get the double. And apparently, Pumpy right now is playing uh, the bassoon in a band of some sort. So I'm, he's not around. So he's my crutch for all things. So I'm on my own. It's pretty scary. Two fourteen, Alex T. Captain working on. Some burns. He's gonna get the burns and open up the well on the right. Tuck for Alex T and bank Tetris and another one. Two long bars in a row. Two Tetrises to show for it. Captain with the S flat column eight nine ten. No problem. Clears way easy and bank Tetris two forty seven. So Alex T up by about sixty thousand here. Halfway to transition in game one of this round one match. All right, the captain will be built for a dirty Tetris, so would like a quick long bar and gets a long bar. There it is, dirty Tetris. 
for the captain. Le captain. <laughs> R. Three R's. 381 for Alex T. 318 for the captain. Alex R and the captain T. Well, we've got Pumpy uh, giving some kudos to Stanislaw. Uh, I mean, Stanislaw giving some kudos to Pumpy. There you go. For getting those YouTube videos up there while they're fresh. Yes, indeed. We had a lot of catching up to do. But he helped us out. So thank you so much, Pumpy. Still, he's not getting any benefits. 1099 all the way. <laughs> Barely, I'm, I'm not even paying him a, a living wage. Is there a CTM or CTWC podcast? There is a podcast called uh, the Peace Dependency Podcast. That is P I E C E, as in Tetris Peace. And you can look that up wherever podcasts are sold. Uh, we flirted with doing a CTM podcast. Uh, I, I want to. I want to do it, but I'm very disorganized. So I need to get a podcast producer and Pumpy is preoccupied. So there you go. A lot of P's for that sentence. 547 for Tetris Alex T. 482 for the captain. So I mean, you know, we, we pay him and I even buy him in the Adobe editing suite. I gave him a subscription to that. So we're, we're taking care of Pumpy, but you know, listen, he's a really intelligent guy. Uh, so he could be making a lot more money, but you know, he loves doing it. And, uh, you know, we pay him a little bit. Honestly, he's making more, <laughs> he's making more from CTM than I am. That's for sure. Pretty much. I'm the lowest paid person involved with CTM. <laughs> The players make more. Pumpy makes more. <laughs> 618 for Alex D. 556 for the captain here on 19. A.O. Pidgeotto appreciates the alliteration. Oh, I get paid an exposure. Oh, that's good. Some exposure. Nobody quotes me in the New York Times. <laughs> Even though I've, I invented everything. <laughs> no, I didn't. All right, Captain with a very uh, dangerous left well, but getting pieces over. There you go. All right, Tetris Alex T, 729. No, King, we all know Kingsman invented everything. <laughs> all right, 761, 679 still. Uh, what do we got? Oh, Alex D piling on some more here on level 23. Line count essentially even. Oh, Captain, not going to get that S over, so that's going to cause some extra burning, but... Should actually burn away fairly efficiently. Oh, surprised you didn't use that T, but that's all right, Tetris. Is that column two, column three, whatever, over on the left for the captain. Back by 86,000 points or so, but Alex gonna pile on another Tetris. Both players level 24, separated by, uh, separated by about four lines. Another one, Alex T, just going ham. He's won two CTMs in a row. And looking for a third. Captain still burning. Alex, he trying to set up. Whoops, excuse me. Trying to set up long bar column nine and long bar column 10. Tetris. Alex 
And Alex T knocking on the door of the max out. Just needs one more line to get it. He got the line. Max out here on 27. Captain up pretty darn high. Not looking auspicious. And he is going to top out 884. Alex is good. We'll give you one solid mullin. So, bad Alex, you can top out if you wish. I do have work in the morning, so. <laughs> but, yeah, mullin. Anytime you get the kill screen, you must mullin. That, or... Everyone will get mad. Um, it's not fair. If he has a chance at a PB. Anyway, but there it is at 1.1. Look at these. I mean, look at this. Nuts. 1.1 here through 235. Amazing. Alrighty, Rue. Two ready players. Game two. 3 2 1. Tetris. I should probably record the audio and the vocal separately so that just in case we get, we've been getting, there's one particular song in the flex style catalog that somebody has like ripped off and uh, whatever there, what's that called when you? have somebody else's song and you're like get, making copyright copyright trolling or whatever i don't know what it's called but yeah there's one of them that we keep getting stricken for well it's definitely called plagiarism i know the word plagiarism but there's something where these copyright trolls on youtube so but now we have to put, put something in writing so that we can monetize one of the vods here it's annoying all right, Alex, he gets a long bar over 73,000. One gap over there in column nine. He's going to work on that. All right, captain with a tuck, 138 and the lead. Getting set up here. There you go, J piece in the J hole. And bang Tetris. And another Tetris for Alex T. Alex T had the Vits, the delayed Vits ready to go. Had to burn it away with a triple and the long bar count comes like not soon after, so. Or just soon after. Not soon after. Sorry, it's late in the day, guys. Work a full day, cook a meal, and then go do Tetris. It's a tough life, guys. All right, Alex T piling high. Oh, nice uh, last moment adjustment with the L to make room for that. Uh, what was that an S? Z? It was a Z. All right, Captain up fairly high. I'm gonna burn all this away. That square was like the worst piece on earth, but it's all right. All right, burning away some of these gaps. He got this weird little secret grade run there in the middle of his stack, but getting rid, rid of that and he will be Tetris ready. So Captain still with the lead. He'll build on it with the long bar. Alex sitting on two Tetrises here. There's one long bar. And looking for the other one. And there it is. So into the lead is Alex T. Temporarily, though. Unless, uh, you yeah, know, Captain here getting a little bit droughted, having to take a triple to bring the stack down a bit. Oh, Alex T with that J standing up in columns... Uh, seven and eight and had to uh, really rip pieces over the top of it so both players withstanding little droughts finally Tetris Alex T and setting up immediately long bar column nine and bang Tetris another one 363 pretty neck and neck right now 
uh, Captain and Alex T are separated by about 5,000 points. Now, oh, line spin. So this is a delayed line spin burn here. And it's going to kind of work out, although he's not Tetris ready. So maybe there was, I mean, I don't want to say that there was something better than a line spin available, but. All right, he's going to make it out, and he is Tetris ready. Got a little notch there. Tucking the T. Alex now has the score lead. But the captain has a small advantage in lines. Tetris for the captain. Oh, Alex is going to try to... He had an opportunity to clear the, the well open on the right side, but he's trying to make this into a, uh, a dirty Tetris, and I think it just ended up costing him more. He tried to save three lines of burning, and now, you know, all at once, and now he's just made a bunch of singles. So, um, a little speculative, <laughs> and he's going to have to take that triple anyway. And he's going to get that dirty Tetris if he can get the long bar. And there it is. Uh, hard fought for that dirty Tetris. Into 19 at 475 for Alex T. And another one, 501. So the captain, should he transition here, will have the higher transition score. Alex ahead now by 10 lines. And captain, 544, 19 transition. Captain, of course, the winner of the Challenger Circuit. That is a theater tournament. If the uh, Masters event is the top uh, 16, then Challengers is the next 16. So a top 32 qualifier fighting his way through the bottom half, making his way into the Masters event. Trying to get a, trying to get a shot at the finals. But uh, has to go through the two-time reigning winner. Alex T. Alex T in a little bit of trouble. That left side, even for him. We'll see. You know, he's not going to get anything over, and he's going to top out. Captain will even it up. A game apiece. Captain, you can go ahead and top out. You have won this game. GG's. <laughs> Captain says, I got one. Oh, hover two. He's deking us out here. All right, there it is. Two hover threes. Game three in three, two, one. Tetris. I wonder how many times I've said three, two, one Tetris in my life now. Many, many times. I guess it's not necessary to say it out loud. There are plenty of restreamers in the Tetris community who do not say it out loud. They just, you know, they just type it in chat and the countdown bot does its thing and players just start when they see it. So I guess I don't have to say it every time. I've definitely said it more than 2,184 times. I guess you could go into the ELO database. I mean, I, it's very rare that I don't say it. So I think you can go into the match database and like find out how many games I've restreamed and then just multiply or just find out how many, yeah, how many games are in those matches and do the math. Uh, I'm sure I've almost certainly said it more than 2,000 times. And you see, man, I've been doing uh, some version of restreaming Tetris matches multiple times a month, many matches since, I don't know, March of 2018, May of 2018, whenever it was. Salted Sofa with a raid, party of five, thank you so much.
Well, yeah, you forget I've done I've done challengers. I've done regular restreams. They're trying to calculate this in the chat. Since when was Sofa a moderator? Oh my, he's a moderator? What? Well, he's, he's a moderator of the Twitch channel because he does, uh, he will stream some of the brackets. 254 for Alex T, 198 for the captain, Bang Tetris. So back by a Tetris and a half is our friend the captain. Oh, Alex T with that uh, weird uh, J piece building around that. Tetris at the bottom, he's going to get that and then go to work on bringing this down as efficiently as possible. He's actually, ooh, she's mad, yawning. <laughs> He's actually gonna get a dirty Tetris over there on the left side of the board, so making quick work of that weird misdrop. Long bar in there for the single. And we'll open up the, uh, uh, the right side and be Tetris ready momentarily, which he is, and immediate long bar for the Tetris 328, halfway to transition for these folks. So we're looking at, at these paces about, you know, just around under and over 600K transition. Yeah, they're still trying to calculate. And of course, you can't forget... Uh, you can't forget um, NGC, man, that I've also done, yeah, CT, uh, CTWC. Oh, Captain up very high on the board and going to top out 338. And Alex is already good, so hopefully no mulling on this one. Should we let him mullin? No, please don't mullin. You won, Alex T. You're getting your heart right now. Yeah, NGC man, I've done I've done CTWC 2019, 2020, 2021. Of course, I've done Tetris Deathmatch. You know, at least uh, 2018 and 2019 I did them. <laughs> so it's a lot of three two ones. Southern Qualifier 2019. I'm, I know I'm a very storied person here. Like, all right, two ready players. Here we go. It is game four. Between Tetris, Alex T, and the captain. Three, two, one, Tetris. And yeah, our alert thing is not going, uh, is not working for Macherino. I'm not 100% sure why. I feel like I've done everything properly. What is that on the right side of the board? I don't know what that is. What is that red? Oh, that's his. <laughs> that's his. There we go. I didn't notice that for a while. But yes, thank you so much, Abby Normal, for the $10 direct contribution. And for those of you doing sponsor quests, I want to thank you all so much. Call you out here. Rayoni Medina. -la. Thank you. Peyton doing sponsor quests. Fargons, T-Storm, Thrash. Nicholas Markovich, thank you so much. Jelly, G's, Heps, all doing sponsor quests and coupons. So I want to thank you all so much for contributing to the prize pool. These players will certainly appreciate it. You know, uh, Alex T needs creatine, man. <laughs> so, you're donating to the Alex T creatine fund. One fifty here for Alex T, the captain with the Tetris. One eighty six. Let 
Oh, true. Yes, they need albuterol for their their asthma. If you want an in, you want in depth reporting on a scandal rocking the classic Tetris world, particularly our top players using albuterol as a performance enhancing drug, you want to check out Classic Tetris News on YouTube. So just go to YouTube, look up Classic Tetris News, and you'll find it They're right there. Shocking report. All right, Alex T, long bar dependent column three, waiting for that bar. And he's going to clear that away. A long bar will clear a single here. And he's going to go to work. Uncovering, and he is uncovered. We're just about halfway to transition, so you can double their scores and see an estimate of what their 19 scores might be like. Boom. Uh, boom. Did I say boom? Oh, my God. Bang. Tetris Alex T. I have to give away a gift sub. If I say boom, I have to give away. See, I, I got to start thinking about uh, CTWC, you guys. Boom. Imagine. All right. So I have to give away a gift sub in the channel, which I will do. Not on stream. Well, should I do it now? I'll do it. I'll do it. How do I do that? Can I do that from here? I don't think I can do that here. I'll have to go elsewhere and do it. But in the meantime, 408 for the captain, 379 for Tetris Alex T. Just about 90 lines in to game four. The captain with the true Vitz and a Tetris as a reward for that. The Vitz, of course, V-I-T-S. That is a vertical eye tuck setup. That's what it stands for, Vitz. Uh, so it is a cousin of the death-defying vertical long bar slide. Made famous in the 2012 documentary, The Ecstasy of Order. Well, I didn't say boom three times. I said it one time and I used, uh, I mean, I used it one time and I said it, I mentioned it. Yeah, there's the use mention distinction in, uh, analytic uh, linguistic philosophy, right? Use mention. There's a difference between using a word and mentioning a word. Certainly relevant to the news that's going on uh, today, uh, you know, this week, certainly using a word versus mentioning it. It's a very tough distinction for to, to make. So 524 here for Tetris Alex T. 550 for the captain. Yeah, I definitely said it three times, but I didn't use it three times. <laughs> All right, 596 for Alex here on 19. Captain still just getting to 19 with a 620 transition. That is a that is a big pace. All right, Tetris for the captain, 658. There is a about a level difference in lines between these two players. So I would say captain has got the pace lead at the moment, especially with Alex's board state. Captain clean, Alex not <laughs> quite clean. And now captain with the true score lead anyway. Game Scout, very based comments. <laughs> oh my God, a based scout. All 
All right, Captain, a little bit of an uncomfortable placement there, but he's going to clear it away and get the Tetris anyway. The rest of this will clear down pretty darn easy. Alex, he clean after all that. Uh, and finally, the Captain is clean. Oh, you hear my chair squeaking around here. All right, Alex T got one. He's built up for another, and we'll be able quickly to get set up for another. And there it is, 881. So just like that, Alex T, again, tied in score, but ahead by about a level's worth of lines in 26. Captain still on 25. 913, Alex, 884 for the captain. So I'd say advantage captain right now. But Alex will have almost, uh, almost certainly more post-28 playability. But you don't know. People can pop off. People can be like, well, they've been training, and now all of a sudden they can do it. So we'll see. I mean, Captain can play definitely a little bit. I think Alex would have the advantage, though. A20 for Alex. He's been going. He's just been Tetris, Tetris, Tetris. And uh, Captain kind of running into some burns at the wrong time. But still captain with lines in hand. Tetris, crucial Tetris. Every Tetris now crucial for the captain. A58 for Alex. Piling up. He's going to have to take an uncomfortable kind of burn there, but no problem. He's going to clear this down. He's on A74 on level 29. The captain is behind. Has room for one more Tetris. This would, this would If he gets this Tetris... And he's going to get that Tetris A99. So we'll see what he can do. Alex is behind, but would be able to make it up. Captain finally with the 1.1. And still going. And he's playing. He is playing. But he's going to top out at 1.103. And Alex is going to get a double. Uh, needs, he needs 2,000 points. And he should be able to line this out. And he is going to line this out on level 31. Forget it. You can't just top out on 29 anymore. Oh my word. Alex clutching out the three, uh, the third heart here on level 31. And the captain, you have been relieved of command in this tournament. The captain is out. Captain, uh, you, I mean, what else can you do? You got a 1.1 and you lost, and this kid is still going. You know, it's going to ha it happens. To everybody now get a 1.1 lose. I mean, even, you know, it's crazy. And Alex, yeah, not able to do much after that, but didn't have to. He's got the 1.139 and the captain. Well, he is out. So anyway, GG's captain. Congratulations on what it took to get here. A valiant effort. But you ran into the buzzsaw that is Tetris Alex T was one step closer to maybe a back three back victory in CTM. Hasn't been done in a long time. Hey everybody, this is your old pal Van Dweller, host of Classic Tetris Monthly. If you like this video, hit thumbs up. If you want to see more videos like it, please subscribe and bang that notification bell. And follow us on Twitch at twitch.tv slash monthly Tetris. Thank you and have a nice day.